In today's Stretcher Dollar, we are still in cold and flu season. And if you've been battling the common cold, we can help. Patricia Lopez has some do-it-yourself home remedies to help you feel like your old self again. This has been a really tough season, Patricia. It's been a tough season for a lot of people. So whether you have a slight cough, a sore throat, or just the sniffles, some of these remedies might just do the trick. And you probably have all the ingredients you need at home. From honey to tea, essential oils, even onions, Tamika Fletcher has used them to cure the common cold and its symptoms. These are things that I've been doing since I was a little girl. These are not actually my recipes, by the way. These are things that my grandmother used to make. She says some of these remedies might be just as good, if not better, than the over-the-counter medicines. And it saves you a ton of money. First up, a do-it-yourself vapor rub. Tamika says you can make your own at home for a tiny fraction of the cost of those drugstore brands. All you need is eucalyptus oil. It opens up your nasal passages. It helps you to breathe easier and better, and it absolutely relaxes you. You can find eucalyptus oil at the grocery or craft store, and you'll also need another oil like coconut, olive, or almond oil. She adds about 20 drops of eucalyptus oil, gives it a stir, and it's ready to rub. Next up, curing a cough. Cough drops aren't all that expensive, but you can make them in a snap at home with honey. You need pure honey. It's a difference between clover honey and pure honey. You boil it till it's about 300 degrees. You can use parchment paper to just drop it on until it's hard. Honey is known for its antibacterial and anti-inflammatory qualities. It can soothe a sore throat and reduces coughing. However, doctors advise against giving honey to infants. If you need more than just cough drops, how about making your own cough syrup using onions? Now, my grandmother used to put a bowl of onions next to her bedside for her cold. And I always thought that was an odd thing to do, but believe it or not, she got better right away. Tamika takes a whole onion and chops it and then boils honey for about five minutes. And then you pour off the honey into another container. And that's just as good as any cough syrup. And the onion is good for your chest, good for your nose, good for decongestion, everything. To help you battle a cold, how about a hot toddy? Yeah, I think we've all heard of it. You can use lemon and ginger tea or any tea that you like. She squeezes half a lemon, adds a cough drop for extra potency, and a tablespoon of Jack Daniels. And it actually opens you up completely faster to me, and it actually relaxes me better than uh, over-the-counter medication. The mixture may ease congestion, soothe a sore throat, and help you sleep. But keep in mind, too much alcohol can make it difficult to sleep, so you may just want to limit yourself to just one. Okay, for making this remedy for a child, Tamika says just swap out the Jack Daniels, obviously, and tea for hot apple cider and add lemon and a cough drop. For more details on the home remedy recipes, just head to abc13.com.